Today we have the highly anticipated Transformer Prime from ASUS. It's lighter and thinner than the iPad 2, despite having a high resolution screen, which is 1280 by 800. The design follows that of the ASUS ZenBooks, which is the ASUS version of the Ultrabook, with a spun metal backing, uh, which gives these new products a very cool industrial family feel. We've got volume buttons, micro HDMI, and a micro SD slot, and headphones on the other side. At the back is a 8 megapixel camera, which has a LED flash. And it also has an f2.4 aperture, which is the same as the new iPhone 4S. And at the front, we've got the 1.2 megapixel camera, which can be used for chat applications. Now the IPS display is gorgeous. It's bright, lots of rich colors. There's actually a setting down here that boosts the brightness for outdoor use. And the durable Gorilla Glass doesn't seem to have added any weight or thickness to the Prime. The most notable technical feature here is the quad-core Tegra 3 processor, which Nvidia claim will triple performance over its current Tegra 2 chip in most honeycomb tablets today. It also has one gig of RAM as opposed to half a gig, which will assist in multitasking and will support lots of open apps at the same time. But this, as you know, is only half the story. When connected to the keyboard dock, this Android tablet transforms into a fully functioning Android ZenBook, if you like. Because the keyboard has its own battery, the combo can be in use for up to 18 hours without recharge. Now, like its predecessor, there are Android-specific shortcut buttons, and I did find myself using a combination of the touchscreen and also the keyboard when they're both connected up. Now, we lined up a couple of music videos from YouTube, and they came out loud and clear. Very impressive for such a small unit. It comes preloaded with Honeycomb 3.2, but ASUS has said that it's slated for an upgrade to 4.0, which is Ice Cream Sandwich. We hope before the end of the year, which will make this tablet one of the most advanced in the world in both hardware and software. So there you have it, the ASUS Transformer Prime. Tell us what you think. We'd love to see your comments below and we'll answer any questions, so feel free to ask away. Until next time.